Okay, okay, right now he's trying to eat it sideways. You can't do that, dude. I think I'll have a nibble. Oh, oh, he almost got it. I'll oh, keep reaching for it. <laughs> what are you doing? Chill! Oh, hi, Bandit. You look a little hungry. It's a good thing today is feeding day. Welcome back to Talking Serpents. Today I'm going to be feeding... Hmm, let's see. Who are all are we going to feed tonight? Um... I'm gonna try to feed Eclipse my yellow anaconda. Bandit, we always know. You know you like food. Pharos, my sun glow bow constrictor. And possibly Mr. Slither's my normal ball python. He hasn't eaten in like, uh, I think maybe slightly over two months, which is very normal. He's, he's eight plus years old and um, pretty normal behavior for a ball python this year since it is. A little past winter season, so he should probably be uh, kicking on the feeding real soon here. I say we start with him. <laughs> so, the snake, which is my normal ball python. He is always, he always seems to eat out of his cave. Let's see if he's in the mood. He may does not be in the mood for some food, so. I'm not getting my hopes up. You'll know when this snake's hungry. You're not sick or nothing like that. If you have a ball python, you know what I'm talking about. Sometimes they just, they go and put that food, they're just not into it. And then one day, you just offer them food and they got their head cocked out of the hole, or wherever you feed your snake, and BAM! You should eat this, sir. Come on. No, it's not over there. Hold on, I gotta have a sip. <laughs> no. You just think if you pretend it's not there, it's just gone. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Come on. It only takes one rat to finally get him out of the uh, little feed strike. Come on, bud. You probably want to hang out, don't you? By the looks of it, he want, he's looking at me, he's like, Hey, you know, I would rather not eat and hang out with you. That's fine, too. We'll have to hang out after, bud. So next, we will be feeding Mr. Crazy. Bandit, the false water cobra. You hungry? Have a good sniff. Realize it's food. You <laughs> 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 did not know you were like, I didn't calculate I was under the line. I <laughs> the log. <laughs> He's apparently too crazy. Come on. Here it is. No, it. No, I didn't. Why are you all there? Let me at least hold it up for you. <laughs> I had it here. At, well, at least it's on video. You're like, it's not me. I, I literally hold it like right there, and he's just like, no, no. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. <laughs> Let's put a clip of that in there. Like, <laughs> young dad in there helping his son with T ball. <laughs> miss. You did a good job, son. You did a good job. I love feeding this snake. It makes me so happy. Round number two. Round 
All right. Okay. Good. Sounds good. Open sesame. Are you pushing yourself into the water bowl? It's like he's fighting his tail and he's like, get this tail away from me. <laughs> Please, sir, I want some more. looking for you. Okay, right now he's trying to eat it sideways. You can't do that, dude. I don't care if you push on me or not. You just can't do it. He's straight dumb. Wanna, no. You can't eat it sideways. Saltwater cobras don't do very well with uh, eating larger diameter meals. Alright, I decided to shut off the camera because I kind of needed to uh, evaluate if it was going to be alright. He is 100% okay. Never seen him do that before. That was very uh, memorable, I guess I'll call it. Yeah, he looks good. I, uh, I'll insert the picture right here of what it looked like. I got a couple of pictures of what it looked like when he was eating it. I got those with my phone. Figured those would be uh, one of those once in a lifetime chances. Alright, you nibbly. Zoning in for the strike. Can I give it a good sniff first? He's thinking, oh yes, it does appear to be a rat. That looks delicious. I think I'll have a nibble. Well, enjoy your nibble. See you later. Alright, and lastly, you're gonna feed my yellow anaconda clips. Um, little story with her. I got her and she was a little bit of a shy eater. And then, probably about like a month or so, uh, into feeding her she finally like came out of her shell so to speak <laughs> and uh, She became like a really fierce eater and I'd be able to take videos of her and she'd be constantly eating and uh, Not be worried about m me being around and uh, Maybe like three or so months ago all of a sudden she's kind of more reluctant to eat around me and it, I don't know why she, she not, hasn't gotten sick. She hasn't had any uh, uh, same enclosure, um, same surroundings, nothing out of the ordinary, so it's kind of odd that all of a sudden she's gone back into be a shy eater. Like, she hasn't had any, like, we we'll call them traumatic, uh, you know, situations between me and Stephanie when we handle her, so everything's really positive. Like, when she, like, when I take her out, she loves being out, and she definitely, um, doesn't have any uh, issues towards me, but she's definitely more of a, maybe it's a something, no, because I've seen... If you know Ari Austinus, he has some uh, anacondas. There's quite a few yellow anacondas, and some of it, I think one of his is a shy eater, and the others just eat like maniacs just in the middle of the day or um, pretty much whenever, wherever. So I'm not really sure exactly what's going on right now. It's kind of odd, but <laughs> right now, if you could put the camera, in, can you put the camera in? She's actually under the substrate right here. Let's see if we can get something. <laughs> so yeah, I I don't know what's you know going on right now. She's she's healthy and everything, but where's her head at right now? <laughs> um, yeah, she'll probably end up coming back out of her shell again, or not.
Well, we don't know. We'll see what the future holds, just like everything else in life. I'm assuming she's probably over there. There it is. Oh, peekaboo. Peekaboo. Here's a rat. This rat's for you. You should eat it. Mm-hmm. Time to flicker. Smells like a rat. I wonder if it tastes like a rat. You should eat it. So the last time we actually had to, because she looked really interested, and as of right now, she looks kind of interested. Usually she'll, um, I can tell she's being a little bit shy because she'll look at it. She smells, she smells the item, the prey item, and then she'll kind of go up and down the item, and then she'll even look at me. Because she obviously, her instincts are taking, her kicking in and saying, I don't know, I don't really trust it. So, if she ends up looking at me, I'll probably end up just leaving it in here tonight and I'll just go into my morning and I'll probably be gone. But, uh, there are other times where she actually daintily, daintily, is that a word? Doesn't matter. I'm using it. <laughs> Correct me if you want. Uh, She'll be really dainty and actually just like put her mouth on it and slightly chomp and then just kind of slightly roll around it and then nibble it down. Yeah, she's she's definitely interested. This is an interested snake. She would completely go the opposite way because I've seen her when she was not hungry. And uh, she's definitely hungry, so hopefully I can get her to engage. Come on, you strike for me. Do it for the YouTubes. Come on. <gasps> is your mouth on it? You should. Come on. Yeah. Do it for the YouTubes. Do it for the YouTubes. Yeah. Do it for the YouTubes. Oh, I'm so excited right now. Yes. Yes. I'll call it a win. I don't care what anybody else says. She ate with me offering the item to her. So let's leave her alone. Let's make sure this is a positive experience for her so that possibly she'll remember for the next feeding that, you know, it is okay if Kyle's going to feed me this delicious rat. So let's slowly close the door and let her do what snakes do. Right now we got Slipknot out. And right now he's actually like four or five days in the shed. curious about the camera. Oh, now he wants to climb it. He wants to come and climb on it. Because that's what you want? We're no longer doing that. Oh, look at the 
there's no more stuff eating. Is that a cigar in your mouth? Or are you just getting done with a rat? Well, I'll leave you to it. All done, are we? You're going. You just look amazing. Enjoy your rat. All right, that's the end of the video. So if you like the video, strike that like button. If you do like my content, please do subscribe. It definitely helps. And uh, if you have any comments, post in the comment section below. I love chatting with you guys. And uh, have a nice day. See you next time.